What's this? Name's Vance Edison. It's hired by a man named Cole Roberts from Jackson Ridge to reclaim this here mine. He rightfully owns it now. Is that right? It's money you paid for it, plus a little extra for showing gold. You can't sell land to a hard-working man, then after he finds gold on it, take it back. This land belongs to the Struthers family. Well, I don't think you're understanding me. I'm here to tell you to clear out of this here mine now. Best take that money and go, Captain. Well, you son of a bitch! Jesse, get down to the river and fetch some water! Oh, I, I think I... Now, damn it! Now you listen to me, you son of a bitch. There ain't nothing or nobody gonna kick me off my land. Now you go on back down that hill and you go tell Cole clear this up. Now you listen to me, you stubborn old coot. I'll give you 10 seconds, gather your things, and start saddling your horses. Maybe we should go see the sheriff now. We ain't going right. nowhere till this son of a bitch gets off my land. Run. Hey, Vince. Look at that. Is that the son of Roy's brothers down there? You shut your mouth. Who's asking? Just a lone traveler. A lone traveler? We ain't kind to strangers around here. You best get on your way. Mister, you need to mind your own business! <laughs> Put your hands where I can see them. Now just who the hell are you and how do you know my name? I'm a very good friend of your father's, son. We served together in the cavalry. Last good friend of my father's just hired someone to murder him.
Who's the son of a bitch that had him killed? Get filth out of here, boys. Move on, you bunch of pack rats! Oh, shoot! It's me, Charlie! Where the hell is Vance, Charlie? He got shot dead. Well, he went after Jesse Struthers. We got Roy, though. But the boy... The boy escaped. He escaped, huh? I mean, goddamn. He killed Vance Edison. Cole, uh, I've been running all day, and, well, I was wondering if you had a little swig of water. Sure I do, Charlie. Just a second. Rest in eternal peace, brother. Amen. Where are you headed? I'm gonna go after that son of a bitch, Cole Roberts, and I'm gonna kill him. Damn, you're bullheaded. Where's your brother? Dad's dead. Yeah, I know. How do you know? I got a letter. A letter from who? It didn't say. Well, it had to see where it was from. Who the hell are you? His name's Virgil Calhoun. I was one of your father's closest friends. <laughs> hey, how about some shots, huh? Toast to dad. Come on. Get up here, Jesse. <sighs> to the late and great Captain Roy Struthers. May he rest in eternal peace. <laughs> that son of a bitch. <laughs> yeah! Come on! <clears throat> God damn it, you two! That's enough! And you two need to start acting like grown men. <coughs> <coughs> Here's to Captain Roy Struthers, a man who lived and died with integrity. Saddle up. We're going to see some friends. It'll be just a moment, dear. Is it all done? Not exactly. Jesse killed Vance Edison and escaped, but I've got somebody to take care of it once and for all. I don't care who you get, just get it done. Soon as he is marked as dead, the county can seize the property. I'll take care of it, Donald. And what about the youngest? What is being done about him? No, he's a leaky vessel. I'll get him to sign over the land. Time is money, Cole.
Carlos? Cole. I need you to track down an outlaw and kill him. How much? Pay you a thousand dollars and bring him to me in a week. Two thousand. That's my final offer. And you get him to me in three days. Been held at your service. Name is Jesse Struthers. Horse? Rides a black mare. Where was he last seen? Red Walk Quarry, about a day ago. You kill him. I'll see you here in three days' time. Billy, you take Curly and you trail him by half a day. And Billy, no matter what, you bring me the corpse of Jesse Struthers. What was that? Jake, put that pistol away. Now. Do exactly what I say. Shiki, ii aste. Nantan chain, andate, micha, anchero. Tia Natsuko, let's get the hut. Let's get hena. Tia ande, nguri andi, utu no gaishi. Danoi des chinihi, she chagashe. Dia, the hajul. Dejenal, deje. Dia, chikanian. Dao, kindela, oka, yusen. Ujura. There for you, my son. And they got Schlera cut. Anchero. Gia. Guinea. Nah. You won't be needing these fine horses anymore.
Old man! <laughs> Well, what's it gonna be? Pistols or knives? I like you. Yes. I think I can kill you with just a knife. I ain't gonna be that easy. It's good, doesn't it? Makes you feel alive. Oh, son of a bitch. Jesse Strutters. I've got to get your corpse back to Jackson Ridge. We do have some time to kill.
damn horses. Gozer. Jake Struthers. Get your goddamn gun away, Billy. I need to speak with Cole. Things have changed. He ain't gonna be happy about this. Virgil! Virgil. Virgil! 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 Ajuda, Landa! Tu quer como se tara? Vá, para nós que a casa, Renata.
Heather, sissy. You're looking beautiful today. Well, can you at least say hi? Lost boy? No, nah, I don't reckon I am. Damn son of a bitch. You shoot, I blow your goddamn head off. Well, why don't you do me a favor and put me out of my misery? Go on now. I think this son of a bitch just might be crazier than I am. Jake? How the hell are you? Boys, put your guns away. Well, yeah, we're respectable members of the community now. So you're here to see Cole, huh? No one else would I be here. All right. Inside. Yeah. Jake Struthers is here to see you. Send him in. Jake, good to see you. Bringing me news of your brother? No news at the present time. I sure hope you're not here to ask for more money. That is precisely why I'm here. I'm done with a dry spell. I figured the last batch I gave you would have lasted longer. I see you pissed it all away again on whiskey and whores. You know, I like you, Jake. You're colorful. You come here and you put your feet up on my desk and you make yourself at home with nothing more to offer me than I want more money. You know, I pride myself on being a good judge of character. So I asked myself, why would he do that when he knows that I'd cut his throat from ear to ear without a second thought? <clears throat> That's exactly what you want, isn't it, Jake? You want me to kill you and end your miserable life because you don't have the balls to do it yourself. You see, I like carrots, Jake. They're predictable. You're predictable.
son of a bitch just doesn't get it, does he? Am I kill him? No. Not yet. While his brother's still out there, he can be of use to us. Anantan, Danastai, be on you, then a kit, a hati, but a dai, a station lau, be kid a e. She get in dash. Do not sit up, Kunt Sakenda. Shikizen, nda. It's in Yana. Zan one Yana, Ostene. Nastene, caninis niza. Nede in Chelego. Kuju. Kuju nda. Okay. No, chon la. Shanogo naste. Tikot. Tuwa. And stere no. Skin shlino. Anna Seth, are you? Nanda are you? The class, the less. That kind da. Nana sell da. Tine silib. Sell da, said. Det sali. Are ku? Anal, said da. She kissing. Da eja, anot. Cole Roberts.
Catch Jesse Struthers. Fetch me some hot water and bring me my tools. Now, damn it! Oh, we've got some moonshine. I'll tell you the truth, I'm a little liquored up myself. Have some of this, it'll help with the pain. Don't waste it, that's good moonshine. Kills the germs. I ought to tell you, it's been a while since I practiced. Get on with it. Must have been real hungry. I can stitch it, but it's gonna hurt some. Friday, we take a week's worth of gold and deliver it to the assay office for a favorable return. From there, my men split the money two ways and escort your share to you and mine back to me. I'm simply amazed at the loyalty of your men, Cole. I just can't fathom it. <laughs> it's not loyalty. You see that? That man was heard entertaining the idea of pinching a little for himself. My foreman caught wind of it and nipped it. If all is as you say it is, this could take our relationship to a whole new level. Glad to hear. Well, <clears throat> I must be going. I have a meeting with my constituents. Sir. Yes. <clears throat> do you know a man by the name of Eli Thomas? Can't say that I do. Eli has this ridiculous notion of running against me for governor. What do you want me to do about it? Well, I was hoping you could uh, make him rethink the idea. I'll take care of it. But I need you to do something for me first. What? I need you to vouch for me. For what? Mayor of Jackson Ridge. <laughs> <clears throat> 
We can do business together privately. But do not think for a second that my reputation can be bought. This town deserves better than you. Stranger, we didn't know if you were going to make it or not. How long? What was I out for? Oh, you know, I'm sorry about this. We just couldn't risk ripping out them stitches and losing any more blood. Oh. You know, I... I need a mirror. You best wait a while till the till the swelling settles. I want to see it now. What did you do to my face? That's the best I could do under the circumstances. You're lucky to be alive. No. You are. for meeting with us. Asun, ku, nagwa yage. Well, I don't know how you deal with this heat. I'm from back east myself, so it's a little bit cooler. All the time I've spent out here, I've never been able to get used to this climate. Ante, ante. Issei, what do you want? I have orders to clear this land. Now, there are two ways we can go about that. The first is to relocate you to some place suitable and give you a large sum of money. Now, that's the way I'd like to do it. The alternative is to forcibly remove you from this land and give you nothing. Now, I don't want to have to do that, but if you give me no choice, I'll leave it up to you. Where the hell do you think you're going? First platoon, post! Thomas. Can I help you? Got a message for you. <laughs> that you should withdraw from running for governor. Is that so? So. Get out of my way. Accidents can't happen, Eli. Who the hell do you think you are? 
You gonna shoot me? Go ahead. I ain't afraid of you. I sure as hell ain't afraid of that Donald Dietz. He comes down here in his fancy suits trying to scare me off. My family's been on this land far too long to be intimidated by the likes of you. You tell your boss that I ain't running, seeing that he's bribed off every last one of my investors. But if I had the money, well, I would run and I would win. You can be sure of that. Yeah! Yeah! No free pokes, there ain't no free gropes, there ain't no free nothing in my saloon. You wanna taste this? You pay Eddie and you take it upstairs. Yes, ma'am. the best part of my week. Should be, but I'm not. I need to find Jake. Jake? Why would you ever want to speak to him after what he did to you? Jake was never one for courage. And leaving me for dead, well, that's something I won't forget. I need his help to go after Cole. But <sighs> I can't be the one to tell you this. Tell me what? <sighs> Sissy, I don't have time for this. Tell me. Jake was working for Cole the whole time. He set you up. He made a deal with Cole in exchange for you. Oh, damn you. Where do I find Cole Roberts? That is just asking for trouble that you don't need. Jesse, don't do anything stupid. Stupid's the only thing I got left. Hey, the boss wants to see you. Who the hell are you? I was just brought on. Hey, uh, water break? I'm all right. Yeah. <laughs> 
I'll show you how to do it. you. Give me that damn knife. You gotta know your knife. Feel the balance of the blade. Know how many revolutions it's gonna take to stick your target. Virgil, what no. you, just, you... you do decide to pull a knife, you better know how to use it. You gotta know your kill shots. Here, here, here. I want you to take this knife. I wanna see you practicing with it all day. You hear me? Yes, sir. Because I might not be around. Watch your back. Uh. Uh. I'll be damned. Jesse Struthers. It's a pleasure to finally meet you in the flesh. You earned that cut, son. I can't afford to have you blow up my mind. Cool Roberts. You're lucky there's bars between us, you murdered son of a bitch. If I'm not mistaken, I think there's a warrant out for your arrest on those charges, boy. I ain't afraid of you. You think you got this town in your pocket, but you don't. There's only so many times you can push a man down before he fights back, and when that day happens, I hope I'm there to watch you suffer. <laughs> They're gonna hang you first thing in the morning. I just want to stop by so you could see the man who took everything from you. We're dangling on the end of a rope tomorrow. I swear to you, you will pay for the murder of my family, whether it be in this life or the next. You sleep good now. Oh, that's right. I forgot. You're an Indian lover now. I'll tell you what. I'm going to sleep with one eye open. Just in case. <laughs> there's your fifty, and there's another hundred. Too rich for my blood. I'm out. Never understood the phrase. Too rich for my blood. What does it mean? Does my blood have a value? Is it any more expensive than, say, yours? What the hell are you going on about, mister? You're more drunk than me. On the contrary, I'm having what I call a moment of clarity. And the name is Benjamin Brown. <laughs> I don't really care what your name is. Are you in or are you out? My, my. Straight to the point. Do you mind if I impart a piece of knowledge to you? Well, it is a free country. The cards you hold in your hands are inconsequential in a game of poker. Wow, that's some impressive advice, Benjamin. <laughs> <laughs> well then, let not another minute go by. Do show us that marvelous hand. But don't be so presumptuous. You haven't seen my cards yet. As I was trying to tell you, it's no use being enamored with a beautiful young woman unless you are absolutely certain she's the most ravishing creature in the room. Oh, House. You cheated. I'm bewildered by the vulgarity of your comment. One should always play fairly, especially when one has the winning hand. I play fairly my ass. There is no way he could have got that hand. I can take many things in this world, but what I cannot accept is an assassination of my character. I leave it up to you.
Just the man I'm looking for. What? You haven't heard. They caught the vigilante Jesse Struthers this afternoon. What the hell are you talking about? He tried to blow up my mind. My foreman caught him and knocked his ass clean out. He hangs in the morning. What's the matter, Jake? Cat got your tongue? <laughs> I've got eyes on him all night, Mr. Blackwood. Don't even think about it. You mind? Please. You're new in town. How about a friendly game of poker? Is that what we are? Friends? You have at it. Would you mind? Not at all. Where are you from? Back east. Oh, a city boy. What the hell are you doing all the way out here? You know? Venture. Hmm. No limit. Fine by me. What can I do for you, uh, Jake? Wondering if I could have a word with the prisoner. You know what's your business with? Him? It's personal. But I said between us. You go and put your pistol on the table. You got five minutes. Ain't no funny business. Oh, my. Must be my lucky day. Friend, you have a look on your face as if you've already won. $2,000. You are feeling quite lucky tonight, aren't you? Very well, then. I'll see your 2000 Four kings. What card do you have? I think you know exactly what my cards are. I think I'm gonna have to call it a night. What, so soon? Let me give you a chance to win your money back. Afraid not. One must have rules to live by in life. Otherwise, what's to separate you from the common animal? Jesse. Well, I don't suppose sorry will cut it this time. <laughs> I just thought you being my brother and all, you would be able to forgive me. You asked to speak to the prisoner, not your brother. You ain't sorry. You just want me to tell you that everything's okay between us. But it's not, and it never will be. 
You're a drunk and a coward and not worthy of the name, brother. I'm done here. This week's take. You thieving bastard. Come in here each week and steal my money. Is there a problem here? There's been a problem ever since you arrived in this town. Careful. I'm done paying you. All you people, you never understand why you pay me. physical violence against women. It's the lowest form of humanity there is. I'm, I'm fine, really. I just need a moment to fix myself up. And we can get to know each other better. I think you misunderstand me. I don't wish to misrepresent myself, but I believe you know Jake and Jesse Struthers. We're done here. Jesse Struther, you have been sentenced to death on multiple counts of murder. At this place and upon this day, the 18th day of September, the year of our Lord, 1869, we hereby carry out that sentence. Yeah. 
You will hang from this rope until you are dead. In accordance with the laws set forth, do you have any final word? I do. So speak them now, or forever hold your peace. The law has told you a version of who they think I am. But I want you all to know that I am not those things. I'm a good man. My father was a good man before he was murdered. But I guess being a good man just ain't enough. I'm proud of who I am and what I've become. Before I hang, I want everybody here to know one thing. That that man right there killed my family and set me up as the murderer. He's the worst kind of stuff. What's the hold up here? We come to see a hanging. Get a move on. I don't think we're gonna see a hanging today, are we, Sheriff? What the hell is he doing? Take off his shackles. Jake, have you lost your goddamn mind? Let him go, or I'll kill you. Take him off! <coughs> Unshackle him. Do it! Jesse, go grab some horses. He's an that lost, Sheriff! You gonna let him get away like that? <laughs> <laughs> You're gonna hang for this, Jake. <laughs> You're coming with us. Jesse. Go on. Get a head start. Don't just stand there! Get off! Go after him! as many as you can before they set up a defensive. I can do that. Kill as many as you can. Where are you going? I'll finish the rest. Easy! 
Go to hell. Not just yet. I'm sending you back to Cole as a message. Uh, this must be your lucky day. I'd rather use you as target practice. Fuck you, Jake. <laughs> Until Cole were coming for him, you hear? What the hell happened to you? You're different. What did they do to you? In all of our years, I've never seen you kill another living thing. There are three dead men down there, slaughtered in a way I've never seen. You didn't even flinch. You may have saved my life today from hanging, but don't think for one second that changes anything between us. You may hate me for what I did, but if we don't stick together, we're dead. Hey! I'm talking to you! Well, she sure seen a lot of riding, mister. I don't know if she could have lasted much more. Well, you take care of her for me. Why, so many people around. There's a big reward out for two brothers. She still brought every bounty hunter into town. $5,000 a piece. What happened to your face, mister? Oh, there's something wrong with it. Boy, head on over, based on a tip. Them McCready boys shacked up with some fat whore over in Silver City. Then I walk in, and I'll be damned if both of those boys weren't there, stark naked, caught dead in the air. Which one of them? She was doing both of them at the same time. <laughs> so what'd you do? Shot fat ass Ned as he tried to run out the back door. Daryl, he pulled the pistol, so I disarmed him with my whip, and I shot him in the head. Now, how the hell did you stop a bullet with a whip? Would you like me to show you? I've got this shiny gold coin. I'll bet you that I can grab that gun out of your hand before you can get off a shot. Now, mister, I ain't looking for no trouble. I just came here for a reward. <laughs> That's a smart move, friend. Have a drink on me. Joe, get him a bottle. <laughs> Looks like the drink's on you. <laughs>
Whiskey. Hey, mister, didn't you read the sign? No one-eyed retards allowed. <laughs> <laughs> I just realized I have no money to pay for my drink. Sure could use a shiny gold coin about now. Looking for a man named Cole Roberts. Anyone know where I can find him? He's in the building over there. You remember the first time we met? You were just a boy all covered in shit. I don't think you'd eaten for days. But you had it. The thing that separates us from them. Murderous rage. From that moment on, I knew you were mine. Those people out there, they don't get us. They don't get where we came from. You think anybody who has power, I mean, real power, is like them? I don't think so. Where are you headed with this? Politics. The presidency. Hell. The whole world. I want it all. I need you by my side, Billy. You're the only one I trust. I, uh, never knew my father. Cool Robert! Cool Robert! Son of a bitch. I mean, it's Edison. Shit. Vance. Good to see you. Hell, I thought you were dead. I was. I've been reborn. Where's Charlie? Charlie's dead. The rumor is you murdered him. I just wanted to hear it from you first before I kill you. Whoever told you that soldier down the river, I didn't kill Charlie. Jesse Struthers did. You expect me to believe that boy killed Charlie? That boy took out four of my men. Hell. He killed Carlos Van Pelt in a knife fight. Vance, why would I kill Charlie? It makes no sense. Nothing need to make any sense for you. Find out for yourself. You see if I'm lying. You bring me that outlaw, Jesse Struthers, and there's a $5,000 reward in it for you. All right, then. But if I find out you're lying, I'm coming back, and I will kill you. Son of a bitch! Follow him. And when he finds him, and he will find them, you shoot them all dead. You got me? 
Can I go with the boss? Shut the hell up and fetch me a drink. Billy, be smart. You understand? Do it. Sunday for the past six months. I want to talk to I've you. I've got nothing to say to you. Get out of here. You're not welcome. I know you don't have any family here. Who's that? It has nothing to do with you. Now don't walk away. She's not yours. And whose is she? It's just a part of the job. Sissy. Don't you touch me! What do you want me to say? I don't even know what I did, goddammit. You, you were the one who wouldn't talk to me. I came to you begging for mercy, and you just kicked me out. Don't you turn this around on me. You weren't there. For what? For me, for Jesse. You sold your own brother out. What sort of man does that? Why did you come here? I need your help. We may have found a way to get out of this. And we can't do it without you. And Jesse needs you. I need you. Fine. I'm not doing it for you. Kissing. Savanyan, Utei Narakailes, Utene Sekura, Sipa, Sipanda and Dosnishi, Nde Kirikayaku, Take no Choren Dilche, Ae, Den Seth, Ketedewa, Shikissen. Good to see you took my advice. Oh, we got company. I'll be damned. You know this guy? Damn right I do. Well, how the hell did he find us out here? Please don't shoot. Sissy. What, you know this guy? We talked a few nights ago. What do you mean you talked? I mean exactly what I said. We talked. I followed the lady out here. She had no idea of my whereabouts. Who are you and what do you want with us, mister? The name's Benjamin Brown and I wish to offer my services to you. 
He's a card cheat and a liar. I bet you you're working for Cole. I can assure you I'm not working for Cole Roberts. And I did not cheat you at cards. You're simply a poor player, Jacob. Contrary to your brother's feelings towards me, my actions here are purely noble. Why do you want to help us? Frankly, I find Cole Roberts to be a distasteful creature. And I wish for him to be taught a lesson. Bullshit. He took you for over $2,000 and you want payback. I don't deny that's part of it. Cole Roberts is a very dangerous man, and what you did by standing up to him, that's never been done before. You have an opportunity to put him away for a very long time. But if you're to face Cole and his men, you'll need more than the three of you. That's a fact. I've seen corruption and greed firsthand. I know what it does. Now, our reasons may not be the same, but the end result is to take down Cole Roberts and what he stands for once and for all. Jake, take his pistol. Bad idea. Maybe. We need all the help we can get. How can I help? All right, then. Here's what we got so far. Cole does business with a silent partner. His name is Donald Dietz. Dietz? Donald Dietz? He's harmless. You know him. He's a regular. Yeah, well, he's the reason Cole was able to legally seize our dad's mine. The plan is to ambush Dietz's money and make Cole out to be the double-crosser. So make him think that he's not giving him his share. Much better than that. What's the one thing a politician wants more than anything? Power. That's right. So we're going to give Dietz a little competition for governor bought and paid for by Cole Roberts himself. Even if we're able to do as you say, how do you know Dietz will do business with you? I don't. But if we offer him the same split he has with Cole, I'm guessing he would rather do business with people like us over a known ruffian like Cole Roberts. Who's in? All right, let's do this. you. Thank you for coming out here today. Now, don't forget to vote. Yeah. <laughs> what a nice thing. Excuse me, Mr. Dietz, sir. You mind if we ask a few questions? Oh, come on in, gentlemen. I always have time for my friends in the press. How do you feel about Eli Thomas's late bid for governor? What are you talking about? That son of a bitch! Can I quote you on that? No, you may not. My response is that I welcome the competition. The good people deserve that, and I am confident that I will be your next government. And that, you can quote me on. Something must be done about this son of a bitch, Eli Thomas! I sent my men to take care Clearly of Clearly, they did an outstanding job. Give it a few weeks and take care of it. I don't want anyone to know I had anything to do with it. I don't like competition, Cole. It's unhealthy for the soul. I'll make it look like an accident. When do I receive my payment for this week? Your payment was sent over two days ago. Well, it never came. Do not fuck with me, Cole. I'm not. I provide power and protection from the law so that you can do the groundwork. If you are not capable of such a simple task, I will look to someone who is. I'll take care of it, Donald. I want my goddamn money. If I have to pay you myself, you'll get it. You're slipping, Cole. Kenny! Where the hell is Steve Aguilar? I don't know. I haven't seen him. 
What's that kid's name? Joe something. Joe Stanford? Get him to find him and bring him to me. Now! Yes, Roger. What have you got to show me? What do you want for him? Three pieces of gold. Three pieces of gold? Try and cheat an old man. I'll give you one piece. Three piece. Ah, Jim, seven, just five. You come out now, mister. Easy now. He don't mean no harm. Ain't that right? He just wants to ask you questions about that white man you told me about. Uh-uh. Get -uh. called Nina. Da. Anda go and say. Get out of here. Are you? Eh, what? You don't want to go? That's all you said. And all, what? Aguli. Hello, Governor. <laughs> I'm so happy you stopped by. <sighs> Patience, my dear. I've got a surprise for you. Ah. I'll be right back. Surprise. Oh, I'm ready. Here it is. <laughs> what the hell is going on? Mr. Dietz, we mean you no harm. We have some information I think you really need to hear about. I'm done here. Cole Roberts is paying for Eli Thomas's election. He wants him to win. He struck a better deal with him, and he's pulling money from the mine to fund it. I don't know what you're talking about. We can prove it. How? We'll show you. And how did you come about this information? I used to work for Cole. What do you want from me? We want our names cleared and our land back. You should know that land is making me extremely rich. Why would I do anything to change that? We'll pay you the same share Cole's paying you. I'll give you my entire share in exchange for one favor. What kind of favor? Do you have anything to do with the relocation of Indians? I might have something to do with that. Why do you ask? Because I have a personal interest in making sure a certain Apache tribe is unharmed and gets exactly what they're promised. So you're telling me if your Indian friends get exactly what they've been promised, you'll give me your share of the mine? We'll draw up papers and make it official. We just want things to go back to the way they were. Fine. If you can prove what you say is true, I'll have my assistant draft up the legal document. That's fine by me. Jake? I suppose so. 
Mr. Dietz, you got yourself a deal. Fine. Now prove it. You're serious. Really? But now, <laughs> I think you're making a terrible mistake. Yeah, it wouldn't be the first time. All right, let's have it your way. No! I believe that last one convinced him. All right then. Now, in a few minutes. There are gonna be three men that are gonna come through that door. And when they do, it's business as usual, you understand. And there's gonna be a slight change of plans. Change of address. I want you to tell them to send the money there. They won't listen to me. Shh, go hide over there. Don't be a hero. If you get them off, my friend over there will shoot you in the back. Oh, what are you doing? Sure, you do your job. I'm coming. I'm coming. It took so damn long. I'm sorry, I, I, I was distracted with work. Check and see if there's anyone else in here. There's no one else in here. Can we dispense with the paranoia and, and, and conduct business? All right, let's conduct some business. Two pounds and 11 ounces, exactly as I expected. Before I forget, uh, Cole sent me a telegram uh, with a new address for where you were to uh, drop off the money at. What the hell are you talking about? You never said nothing about no change in address. Yeah, well, that's why he sent the telegram. Give me that address. Pleasure was all mine. They're gone. Let's go. You're sure there were two sets of tracks? Yes, sir. One of them shot Steve Aguilar in the head. I buried him out there. I bet it was Jake. I should have killed that little shit when I had a chance. Why would they go after the money? They're trying to lure me out. Lure you out for what, Cole? I don't know. They're planning something with that money. But what? Are you sure this is the right place? Yeah. Mr. Thomas? Yeah? Package for you. Wasn't expecting it so soon. Well, this money is for Mr. Dietz, right? Son, this is all for Mr. Dietz. Make sure you tell our friend thank you very much. How's that for partnership? You'll have your land back before the end of the week.
ikshu no tau te no one in zage no kissen are you nanda e to ni outsai jaltera tia kejen an deu i del seta an sadi Tithlau, stēlā. Koth nau stēlnā. Koth nēnā. Koth tu. Nuki. Sūkush. Ah. Eres kā tu. Tia, sana kakari nda, ni nzanaura au ni. Wad, ana a, kathu te. Ushi kesen, sana tsai. Tau te, ana no kihi, ayuna kayu, ana unsa. Te ka tu endoa, anetse tseni o hawa, ta no takani. Ansa, o no neof neko, no hoa, no tago. Te a ikshu. Tia tu, in sera, in ta i ho mi ta no, in na ge to ni no, ne ot le a kia de a ka. In sa, se to in da, bi ke hu an toa. Iu en ya en ya she, Utsara. Are you? A cleth no way. My show way. Should kiss him. Ku, ane sertne, atendi, ya, daerlet, of miko ayazi, nazi ski en lethe, tapi, no shetzana, shajiel mariel. Shetsana Tadesilo. Look on Ed's face when I told him that there weren't any bullets in the chamber. He peed his pants, did he not? <laughs> yeah, he did. He did, Jesse. He peed himself. <laughs> I wish you could have seen the look on Deet's face when he found out he'd been betrayed. He nearly popped a blood vessel in his head. Time to draw, gentlemen. Jesse! 
Jesse! Jesse! Jesse! Oh. Okay? Yeah. Yeah, it's just, yeah. just a graze. Where's my pistol? Where's my goddamn pistol? <laughs> Jesus brothers! I know you're here! I can smell your burning flesh! Mister, I don't know who the hell you are! It don't matter! You stole my goddamn mare, I'm gonna bury you alive for that! I enjoyed killing your father! The look on his face was worth it!
Remember, I will always be with you. It was an accident. to hit Struthers. Well, you didn't. Get the doctor. I'll boil water for the doctor. Don't you die on me, Jacob Struthers. I can't live my life without you. I don't want to. He's fine. A few more hours, there wouldn't have been nothing I could have done. Can I see him now? I don't think that's a good idea, but I can tell. That's not going to stop you, so make it quick. He's very tired. Don't say a word. 
wasn't supposed to be like this. I was finished with you. <laughs> what did you say? Tena nuishi. Dona gu. Aga una ishi. Auna ayada. Ya tana leke tu. Na sekana. Yota ha. Na tenera. Tena tenera. Yo we etni. Atsa. Kitsen sharokantan. Justice Brothers. God damn. I'm just kidding. God damn, he's a hit him, son of a bitch. You guys asked the sheriff. Yeah. Get him up. Look what just showed up. We get Doc Stevens. I know what's been going on. I'm on your side. I thought you'd like to know they found Jesse. He's all right. He's with the doc now. Ah, oh, wonderful news. Where are you going? I have some business to take care of. I'll be back shortly. Release the prisoner. I'd be happy to, but on whose authority? On mine. I am arresting Cole Roberts on three counts of murder, larceny, and an attempt to defraud the state. So I suggest you take these men and you go arrest him now before he slips through your fingers, Sheriff. Yes, sir. Come with me.
Cole Roberts, you're under arrest. Come on out with your hands up. I'm out here with three U.S. Marshals. You do not come on out. We will be forced to come on in. Break that door down. He knew we were coming. What the hell do you have to say for this, Sheriff? Three little mice run down a hole, get stuck. First mouse, he starts to panic and squirm, trying to find a way out. But there ain't none. Second mouse, he can't believe he was stupid enough to fall into the trap. So he just withers away. Third mouse. Final mouse. He kills the other two and eats them. A couple weeks later, the trap opens up and he walks out alive. I never would have guessed that'd be you. Look. It's an improvement. Yeah. yeah. I'm just glad you made it back. Well, I'd be dead if it wasn't for you. You saved my life. Why? Why in the hell did you do it? You just took a bullet from me without a second thought. But then you go off and make a deal with the devil for my life? I mean, help me to understand it here, because I, I just don't get it. I don't know. <laughs> I just don't know. I can't accept that. You see, I don't trust you, Jake. Look, I, I want to. But I just don't know why you do the things you do. Like, ever since we were kids, you went out of your way to hurt me. What are you talking about? Are you serious? How about when you stole my horse, got drunk, and lost her on a poker game? Or what about Lori? Oh, the only girl I ever loved, Jake, and you fucked her to spite me. And worst of all, when I had a knife thrown into my shoulder, and you left me to die. Now, how could you do it? When all I've ever done is love you. Well, all I've ever done is hang you! You were always his favorite. Oh, Jesse can do no wrong. Oh, hey, Jake, look at that. Why can't you be more like him? And what was, what was I, huh? What was I? I was the shit on the bottom of his boot heel! Do you say everything has a purpose in life? Well, what's the purpose of his fist hitting my face whenever all I did was work just as hard as you? What is the purpose in that, Jesse? It's because you were his son. I wasn't. 
What? Roy wasn't my father. Virgil was. He took me in when Virgil couldn't handle it anymore. Roy was so hard on you. So every time he looked at you, he saw himself. I don't believe you. Why would he do that to me? Why wouldn't he tell me? Why wouldn't he treat me like his own son? I don't know, Jake. Well, that's not good enough! It's not fucking good enough! It's not good enough! It's not good enough! It's not good enough! It's not good enough! Do you hear me? It's not good enough! It's fucking not Man. Good to see you up and moving around. Here is the agreement we discussed. Ready to be signed. Where's Cole? Someone tipped him off. Turn up soon enough, and when he does, I will deal with him. Our deal with Cole was either dead or behind bars. I'm not signing anything until that happens. Very well. I have my people searching the area. Can't be long. Call mysterious has slipped away, huh? Gee, I wonder who could have tipped him off. Hey, has anyone seen Benjamin Brown? <laughs> he saved your life. He just may surprise you. Oh, yeah? Where is he now? No hard feelings? No hard feelings. Jake? Sheriff. You tell him what you told me. I didn't mean no harm. Tell him! Tell me what? One more regulars come visit me last night. And after we did our thing, he's getting all ready to go when he hands me a piece of paper. Tells me, make sure I give this to Jesse Struthers. And what else did he give you? Go on. All right. I wasn't going to keep it. Honest, I wasn't. It was just so pretty. I just wanted to have it for a little while, that's all. Please, mister. I didn't mean no harm. See you in there. It's not cool in there.
Aku kentan a. Just give me that letter now. What am I gonna do with you? You just don't die. It's such a shame, because I got this pretty little engine here who tells me the strangest thing. She's your wife. Let's make a deal. Her life for yours. Which one dies is up to you. You remember Red War Quarry, don't you? Come alone. Are you crazy? It's a trap. He's not gonna let either of you out alive. I know that. Well, then why the hell are you going? Let the marshals go after them. You never asked me why I came back. Well, I thought you would tell me when the time was right. Fear. Complete and utter fear. What does that have to do with anything? The day when you left me, I thought I was gonna die. I thought it was the end of my life, and in some ways I wish it was because I haven't been able to stop thinking about it since. It feels like I've been holding my breath this entire time since Roy was shot. I just wanna go back to living, Jake. It's all I ever wanted. But if I don't face this now, I'll never be able to live right again. Even if it costs you your life? Even if it costs me my life. Okay. Then I'm with you. Let's go find this son of a bitch and finish this. No, Jake. I have to go alone. Wait. There... Listen, there are things going on right now that I can't explain to you, but you're gonna have to trust me. Hey. I'm not afraid anymore. I know what I have to do. You stay here with Sissy. You two build a family. Do some good in this world. I'm proud of you. My journey ends here. Hell with that. Where are you going? Let's get help. But Jake, you can't. He's gonna die if I don't do something. We don't have time for this, goddammit. My dear boy, we will make the time. I need you to send an emergency dispatch to Captain Samuel Whitfield, 6th Cavalry. We've located Cole Roberts. Stop. He's at the Red Rock Quarry. Stop. Coordinates attached. Come at once. Use extreme caution. Send that right away. You better ride hard. I ain't waiting for you. I mean, I look like much young man, but I can hold my own. Let's go. Listen up. I've got something to say. We found Cole Roberts and his posse. And I'm gonna take him down! But I can't do it alone. I need your help. Every one of you knows who he is and what he's done. And we have let him get away with it for far too long. Now, I'm not pointing any fingers here. We are all guilty. Especially me. This is our chance to take back our town! 
Now who's with me? Pete. How many times has he come into your saloon with his man and taken whatever the hell he wants? Huh? Lots of times, I suppose. And what did you do about it? Did nothing. Well, now's your chance to do something about it. Every one of us. Now who's with me? Come on! Come on down from there, Jake. I'll buy you a drink. Let's let the authorities take care of it now. I want you all to remember this day, this moment. Jake Struthers, the town drunk, the lowlife, the one that you all laughed at behind my back. This is the day that I went after Cole Roberts when no one else would. Come in. Leaving us? It's time that I move on. Life with just one man. No, sir, that ain't no kind of life for me. Did I ever tell you I was married once? I didn't know that. Not the kind of thing you share in this business. Thought I was in love. Even when he beat me senseless. Finally summoned up the courage to leave that worthless freeloader and I ain't never looked back. Never understood love. Just didn't see the purpose of it. Till seeing you with Jake. Makes you realize there's still a lot of learning to be done in this world. Here. Take this for Jake and the doctor's lodgings. No, you keep it. Thank you. Thank you, Edna, for everything. You're welcome. Now, I don't want to see you back here. Not ever again.
got you now. I guess they know I'm here now. That's far enough! I'm here as promised! Now let my wife go! Because I have something that you want! This is the original deed to the mine. You hear me? No more hiding behind deets anymore. You let her go, and it's yours. You mean my gold mine? Not anymore. Deed saw to that. Property's been seized by the county. Where did you get that? It was well hidden. Well, well, well. It seems like we both have something the other wants. Show me the paper. Show her to me first. Bring that engine out. What you saying? She says, how much men you have. Let them go, Dante. Iku. Oro. Klauenschle. Dini hibida. Ante hibida. Dan zula e. Te salaku. Akia esteti. Ana jande plani. Shatin june. Tsana nakish. Hende. Tsana kai. Ana. Tsana june clash. Dia. Kotsin shiego. Jesse. Oh. Oh, sasen chao. Ja konjulish. You want it? It's yours. This ends now. Bring it to me. No. It's not gonna work like that. You give her a fresh horse and some distance, and then I'll do whatever you want. Out of Joe. It's no what's.
Ku Onedeha Nanta Nanta We have to go down there and help him. Not till my men come, we won't. But they're gonna kill him. Son, you don't know how many men are down there. You might be walking into a trap and not even know it. Well, that's easy for you to say. He's not your goddamn brother. I left him before. I'm not gonna do it again. Leave me. Sign it. Sign it. Good. Very good. You didn't think I was stupid enough to let her go just like that, did you? Son of a bitch! Now, now. Let me introduce you to a very old friend of mine. You remember Vance Edison, don't you? Out of your neck. Pretty little lady, got her struthers. Looks like she loves you a whole lot. I ain't afraid of you. You're gonna be a boy. Believe me, you're gonna be. Before I kill you, tell me one thing. What happened to my partner? What are you talking about? <laughs> <laughs> that was for Billy. You son of a bitch.
down. There's too many of them. Is that the best you got? I overestimated you, Struthers. I thought you were smarter than that. <laughs> Gentlemen, shall we?
fight me like a man. Come on! Follow me, boy.
Oh, shit. You look good. You should see the other guy. I, I gotta ask you, how did he know that you were here? Remember when I said he just may surprise you? You mean you both were in on this the entire time? I had to have him get Cole out of town, and I needed to know exactly where he was so we could go after him. Well, why didn't you tell me? I couldn't risk it. No one knew. I'm sorry, brother. Huh? 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 Uh. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> and you! You are a no good, car cheating son of a bitch. But you sure got one hell of a poker face. Thank you. You're welcome. I'm on off. Identify yourself. I'm just a gold mine. I'm out here doing my job. The Apaches, they attacked us. They're killing everyone. Mayor Beach is dead. What is your name? My name? My name? They are killing white folks right now as we speak. All right, Saunders, Mitchell, Wilson, flank left. Inns, Maddox, O'Reilly, flank right. The rest of you come with me. <laughs> لا 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 
Valo Narakai! Nasa ni Nata! Shishanotsa Nagari! Doshi Dantar! Doshi Dantar! Pilos! Chanadot! Ila Pilinzu Dashatra! Do Kanane! Kanane! No! No! Shita! No! Shita! No, no, Shita! Inde! No! 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 No!